G'day guys, this topic is all about the economics of information and in this first video we'll have a look at how lack of information is a source of market failure and we'll work out what the optimal amount of information is to obtain. So to see how a lack of information is a form of market failure, let's first consider the case where there is not a lack of information. So if we're at market equilibrium, we assume pretty much perfect markets with all the information we need, we know that our surplus looks something like this. What is going to happen if there's a lack of information? Well, what actually happens is that effectively the demand is reduced from what it should be. Now this curve up here shows the actual benefits that are available to consumers and what consumers would get out of buying the good. But demand is lower than that, not because the consumers are making a choice to forego surplus, but simply because they aren't aware that there is surplus available that they're missing out on. There are some consumers out there who would buy a good if they knew it was available at the price it was, but because they don't know, they don't end up buying. If they were made aware, then the demand curve would be pushed up and we wouldn't have this deadweight loss. So this deadweight loss here indicates that a lack of information results in an inefficient market. So obviously consumers should seek to obtain information. The more they